All right, someone hit confirm. And uh, here we are, Money Show. Which one is this, Ruth? Money Show 7, Money Show 8? You guys barely I, I fit think, in here. <laughs> I know, we're so tall, dude. I'm like, I think it's seven or eight. I don't know. I know it's uh, it's money show and it's important because the Patreons are important. Right, so I said we weren't going to talk about the game because it's money show, but I guess we, you do need to kind of know what we're doing here. Uh, we're infiltrating this building. There are enemies in here. Uh, we have to find like an explosive or something and disarm it. Uh, something like okay. that. I don't quite remember exactly what it was. Oh god, my gun! But my whole thing with this game before was... Whoa! I, could I just, can't get my gun. I dropped it, and now it's gone. You're too t it's right there. Oh. I see it. You're dropping all uh, your shit. Oh <laughs> well, even when I'm ducked down, I can't grab it. Um, I'll drop my gun. I now. need magnet hands, bro. I need magnet hands, dude. You're too tall. I told no, you No, but I, even when I'm... Look, I, could, I dropped my shit and picked it right up. I can't pick shit up, bro. Yeah. I like the guns, man. The guns feel and sound good. And Sion will be happy to know that they have recoil. Here. How come I can't pick up my gun? That is ridiculous, Because you're dude. too tall. Something's wrong with your setup, dude. You're too... Your floor settings are messed up. In, in... Well, well, you're... you're gr surely picking up stuff easily <laughs> i am you're no i'm watching you try to pick up my gun and you it's can't be, it's because it's your gun not mine well what did you also did you just drop what's that other gun you're trying to pick up this one i just picked up you mean okay but look yeah i'm i i don't know what i mean outside of quitting and coming back i've calibrated my height like six times i don't know what else to do yeah it's your it's your floor settings in your like uh use toggle grab for guns and items well i know what's in my floor settings i've done it oh god that's cool um <laughs> this is so stupid dude okay um i don't know what else to do yeah, I guess it's much of a breach if I can't get my gun. All right, so let, let's leave the game. What I want you to do, I want you to completely leave Steam VR. I want you to go into your Oculus Home and reset up your your Guardian boundary and set your floor height again. Because that's the problem here. Your floor height's fucked up. That's why you're ten feet tall. That that's why you can't reach your guns because your floor height's yeah. fucked up. Now you might oh, be able I've to do that. you might be able to do that in Steam, uh, or you might have to do it in Oculus. But but that's that's the whole deal here. You're you're eight foot tall, and you can't mm. reach the ground. I could pick your stuff up for you, but it won't let me grab your stuff because mm. it's yours. Oh, I did here. Yeah. <laughs> 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 all right i'm leaving i'm gonna i'm backing out i'll be back all right. I, I guess we might we're gonna have to do this whole thing over uh yeah. as far as getting back in the game okay yeah we'll just kill the game interesting though i did that though i did i, I reset my, my calibrated i did all that but i'll i'll, I'll do it again uh sorry if you're a man i feel bad we, we ditched her well she's not a subscriber so that's right if she was patreon we should be in here with us right now absolutely which we might do this again with Patreons if we actually end up having fun with it. I like. Yeah, there, actually, I was talking to Bridger right about that. There's stuff to like about this, okay? Uh, the guns, they look and sound and feel good, for, especially for one of these blocky Minecraft-style art-type deals. The game actually looks and, and plays pretty good. The thing is, is that the fucking AI are stupid. And so do you think they'll fix that in the... Um... They may have already the fixed accident. it. They may have already okay. fixed it. What I did last time, I played like four or five games, is I would just move around the outside of the compound here like this. I'd find a nice high spot where I could see in. And then I would start... Oh, I like the sight. I'd start to pick people off. Now, 
the site's pretty cool. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So this is already better, but the, the landscape isn't allowing me to shoot over the fences like it used to. Like used to, oh, there, oh. I see it. It's over here. <laughs> okay. Hey, you know what? I'll tell you what. Look at the wall with the barbed wire. It almost looks like the state capital, the United States. <laughs> yeah, it does, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah. All right. I think so, I saw Nancy Pelosi in there. Let's get her. <laughs> oh, God, dude. Did you hear that? <laughs> Did you imagine if this Those was a public post- video? Right. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Somebody posted something on the Facebook about, uh, you know, they wanted to stab her in the brain or something. And now they're using that as it's saying that, that they were, uh, there to kill her. All right. So I don't see any, uh, action on the perimeter here. Normally there would be a dude on the roof, but there's like, I think it's because I think Fiora took care of him already. Possibly. So we got to go in this way, right? Yeah. What's happening? I see shadows. Oh, it's from the rock. Okay, I thought maybe it was getting darker. Or something. All right, so they got the windows boarded. We just want to move in slowly. Now the idea here, like the 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 idea, the game that they sold people was you're using explosives and shit to breach these. The and breaching. We, and we do have we have wall charges. We can make our own door if we want to. But I've never had to do that. Right, I'm going to put my rifle down and grab my pistol since we're going close range here. Here we go. We're in. Here's the door. All right. Should I breach? Drop my gun. So, um, so there, none of the doors are open now. How do you, how do you start the charge? No, uh, before when I played, all the doors and windows were just open. Like, you could just go in. Okay. Well, I just put a charge on that door, but I don't know how to blow it up. So, literally, hold on here. Literally, every door and window is boarded up. Like, all of them. Yeah. So, did they just go in and board everything up? I think they must have. What are they doing in there? It must must be the fucking government in there. It must be, but I don't know how to oh, how to breach this thing. I, I mean, I put on the wall. I've and never actually used that thing before. Did you? All right. Is it red or green, the light on it? It's green. So you did arm it. Maybe you just have to get, well, you did get the hell away from it. Yeah, but I don't. All right. So I put mine on there. Do I keep? I shot it. That didn't do anything. All right. So let's. Let's get away from it here. And What's this? Did you drop something? I don't think so. Did I? I found a, it's a bolt or something. It's like rolling on the ground. It looks like maybe... I tried to pick it up. wouldn't let me. It's not letting me grab it either. I don't know what it is. It's just debris. All right, what uh, is it with the charges, man? I want to blow this shit up, dude. It's not... here. Oh, God. What'd you do? I know. The door just blew open. Was it me or you? You're... Yours, but I don't know. Oh, there's people in there. I got both of them. All right, nice. Uh, I pressed... Oh, there's... Do you know you can jump? Pushing the joystick, right joystick? Oh, there you go. No, I was pressing buttons. I wonder which one worked. Oh, oh God, the X, uh, the X button. That's what blew mine up. <laughs> we breached it. We did it. We did it, Wes. Okay. Uh, well, oh God, they're here. They oh, are. My, I'm out of bullet. I'm out of bullets. How do I reload? I don't know. Oh, there we go. Um... Shit. Fuck. I don't know how to re- I don't know how to reload. Okay, there we go. I got it. I'm so fucked, because I don't know how to reload either! Ah! Uh, you gotta- I'm dead. You gotta pull- there's a little bag next to you. You push a button and then it drops it, but I don't know how to- I don't know how to cock it, like... Um, oh, no, I'm, now the game's broken. I come in the floor. 
I died and like I'm flying away to go into heaven. Bye, Roots. I'm going to heaven. <laughs> oh, no. I, I am, you can't. I, I don't know how to reload. <laughs> All right. I'll come back down from heaven just to see what you're doing. Are you outside? Dude, I'm, I, Do you see yeah, me in the sky? I'm, like I don't. I, I'm here. I can see you running around. I, um, okay, I can draw. I can, I'm coming to you. I can, All right. I'm with you now. I can, I, okay, I'm, I can, I'm inside I your clip. I, um, my hand is on your clip you just dropped. Okay, so I just I just put a new clip in, but I don't know how to like reload reload <laughs> this it. Is fucking hilarious. When I click, <laughs> when I push my button, it's not it's not shooting, dude. Oh god, hey. I can go anywhere okay. now. I died, and now I can fly anywhere in this map just by looking, really? just by looking and pressing forward on the joystick. I just want to know. Maybe it's okay. Wait. There's got to be a way to cock this gun, man. Like, I put a clip in. It's new, no, but it's not firing. It's not firing, so... I wish I was alive to figure it out for you, man. Well, I'm going to handgun it. I got some ammo right here. I'm going to go avenge you, bro. All right, I can tell you where they're at. Hold on a second. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> Dude, those guys are... Well, I gotta, no, I gotta no, tell no. you, they're way smarter than they used to be. Okay, I gotta get new gun. I gotta get new ammo. How do I reload this one? They like to walk in place, like all of them. Oh, yeah. okay, yeah. So I was able to reload this, um, just by cocking it, recocking. There we go. Failure. Okay, so we gotta figure out how to reload, man. Like this that's kinda crucial. Yeah, I agree with that. We should probably do that before we breach the compound. Hmm. Are we coming back oh hey, we're here. Now these are that's procedural. Sure. So like infinite building be layouts, supposedly. But for some oh, reason like okay, the well, outside always seems to be the same. Alright, well. so let's figure this out. Fire, 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 fire. Alright, now I'm out. So my, hit your um, yep. Yeah. Grab a new clip. clip. There's got to be a way to okay. reload to actually something to grab on right. here. To so I, I've got the pistol figured out. You just yeah, the pistol's it. fine. Now yeah, this you're shooting me and it's hurting. By the way, is it really? Yeah. Hey, don't what are you doing? Don't hurt me. See. All right. Okay, so how do I? All right, my thing is out. We hit. X to drop the clip. Grab a new clip. And let's see here. Yeah, it's right where you think it would be, man. I don't know what if you, you have the same gun as I do, but the, the thing's right here. This. Yeah, I've been trying to grab... Oh, now it lets me do it. Okay. Wait, but it's not... Did you, not pull, did you pull it? Like, physically pull yeah. it? Yeah, watch. There we go. Okay. Yeah. All right, let's go. We got this. Um, although you almost killed me. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty close to dead myself. All right, so let's go. Uh, let's get. We got this, bro. Now I can jump. Uh oh. I'm gonna breach this shit. We're breaching it, bro. It's breaching. Right here. You ready? Yeah. I don't need another breach. I just want my gun. Thank you. Okay. Procedural. Yeah, this is already... I mean, even with the jank, this is already like 10 times better than it was last time I tried it. So when did you play it last? When it first launched. Okay. Like when it first, first launched. Like within days. Okay. Do you watch out here, somebody? <gasps> hey, somebody's behind the... They're in there. They're in this straight ahead. Scared, Wes. Got one down. Hey! Somebody's in there to the right. Oh, shit. He just got me. Alright, flanking. Got him down. There's a lot of doorways here. Hey, somebody's getting me. I'm dead. Are you dead? You can fly now, right? I'm floating, yeah, I'm flying. Anywhere you look, you can press forward and go. It's 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 gaze-based, so 
Like, you can fly That's... to heaven, or you can come in the building with me. Well, I see you. I started to go to heaven, but then you needed help, so I came back for you. <laughs> Appreciate that. But I'm going to continue to try to win, but we can still do money show and talk about our topics. Oh, absolutely. While I do this. Um, so the first thing I want to talk about is the thing that everybody's been talking about for some odd reason. This Oculus Quest 3. Now, for some reason, and I, don't, I can't begin to fathom why, this is news to people. The Oculus is working on their next headset already. Roots, are you surprised <laughs> that Facebook has already begun work on their next headset? No, and it, the thing is, is the the fact that it's been uttered, everybody's uh, like assumes it's coming out like next week, right? I mean, I've already sold my Quest too because I got it. I mean, what's the point of keeping it? Yeah, I've even seen yeah. news sites report that Quest Three is coming now in twenty twenty one. He never said that, dude. He never said that. All he said was that they're working on the next hardware and that it would be uh, the Quest 2 stuff would be forward compatible with it the way the Quest 1 stuff is forward compatible now. That's all he said. He didn't say anything about time frame or features or anything. And people just took it and ran with it. Ah, bastard. Uh, Did you die? No. Not yet. I've killed a bunch of these dudes though. One to the head's all it takes, Roots. And they're done. I still haven't found the like explosive though. I might need to go upstairs. Oh, somebody's coming down. Oh, no, they're not. They're in the next room. Where are you at? I hear you. I don't see anybody. I hear a bunch of dudes somewhere. Fuck, I'm dead. I don't even know where they came from. I just know that I got one in the back How of the head. Are they, does it seem like the guys are harder to kill them than they used to be? Dude, it's, yeah, I mean, I played this game like five times last time. And uh, I played by myself, and I never lost. I never came close to losing. They barely even touched me. Hmm. So, yeah, I, basically what I would do is I would sit out here. There were no boarded up doors and windows. They could just come out. And they did. They just came out, and I picked them off right in the yard. And there might be two left in the building. I'd go in and kill them, and then i win. Over and over again. So this is already way better. Well, that wasn't a good spot. Now, I would like uh, some way to see in a little bit and tell where these guys are at. So we could... You can, right here. Where we, So we could tell... Oh, we just walked right on through that, huh? Push, yeah, push it. The fuck out of the way, bro. I still have oh, a charge. This? If we know where the guys are at, I have a charge. Oh, you can just push everything away, dude. Around, dude. Yeah, it's uh, destructible environments. It's uh, shit's supposed to fly when you blow it up. But right. um, but yeah, I, I I couldn't believe just how the people ran with that Oculus Quest three story, like like and um, reputable reputable people that usually don't right yeah like yeah. it makes you feel like they know something more than we don't it's like something. obviously they would be working on the next headset you don't make a headset overnight bro obviously they're working on it uh they're probably already but, working on four you know what i mean well they've got half dome out there somewhere Whether yeah we saw three half right. domes they've shown us three half domes right so that's confirmed, right? Half Dome 2021, three of them, all three of them coming yeah. this year, right? Yep. Now, let me ask you this. Is there any part of you that believes that... Um, Why is this boarded up? It's going to be a PC VR first slash standalone, because Mash Daddy said that, and I don't know where he got that either it's from the... It's just uh, all wishful thinking. I don't think so. I think that uh, we're going to see better PC integration going forward. Uh, of course, we're going to see improvement on all fronts, and PC being one of those. Um, and I, I do, I do have a more optimistic view of the future of PC VR now. Uh, when I'm seeing all the success that Steam VR is having, when I'm seeing how cheap the uh, the entry level hardware is getting, uh, I feel better about PC VR now and PC gaming in general than I did a year ago. Um, 
with that said i think that oculus will roll with that and i, I don't think they're ever going to do a standalone pc thing again but uh i do think that they're going to support support uh both uh both platforms i guess i gotta put my gun away to blow that thing up you shouldn't have to i don't think i, I didn't it. x it's not doing anything whoa it's y what oh the god fuck? what's happening well, i don't know i just blew up am i dead i'm dead Did you... what happened what? you're yes no something exploded I don't know. who's this guy laying on the ground over here that's you that's me i'm ugly this is you right here yeah your head's bopping around dude oh, don't leave me here something Rose. weird is happening i don't know what's happening it's all right, I'm going to find the people and the bomb, and I'll tell you where they're at. Oh, that's okay. the reason it was boarded up, because this is the door going outside. Oh. Okay. Um, Let's go upstairs. I don't know. Mm -hmm. All right. Where is it? Upstairs, okay. No, the upstairs is over here in the other building. Okay, there's dudes upstairs over here, or at least one. Other building? There's two buildings? No, I mean, there's a other the other wing to the building. You, I'm not seeing any going through there. You, there's a charge on the ground. I bet that's what I, uh, wait a minute. It says front toward in. Yeah. There's a charge on the ground. I bet I walked into a fucking trap. What was that? I just blew up a wall. Oh, how'd you do that? I don't know, but I'm not, you're, I am you, not you're, seeing. You already used your explosives. How'd you blow up another wall? I had a second one, I guess. Oh, okay, yeah, uh, yeah. You, I, I forgot I you have a different charge out, a oh. different loadout. All right, so I know where dudes are at. They're they're all over this second wing over here. I can't go. I but I don't know where the second wing is. Walk through the the door uh, that I just blew open with my bomb, and and you'll see a wing with a second floor on top of it, like a room on top of the building, and that's what I'm. All right, I'm with you now. Um. Let's see here. Where is it at? Okay, you're right at You're looking like to your left. No, not that one. This. This is where the people were at. In this other one here. In here? Yeah. Now, I don't know how you'll get in there. <laughs> without That's any the thing. Explosives. I don't have a bomb. Yeah, I don't think there's any way into it unless there's a hallway or something. What is that noise? I don't hear it. You think this is an intentional uh, feature, where I'm, the way, letting me fly around like this? All right, so obviously, uh, right there, you can see where they connect that, man. You're going to have to go back in the, this door that we made and then uh, go is, go down that curtain. There is, there is no way to get through. Like, I can go down here. It dead ends. Yeah, I'm looking at it. Yeah, you're right. Look at your head, dude. It's all bobbing around, bro. Can you see me now? I think we're going to have to we're gonna have to restart the level. Can I kill myself? Probably. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I'm going to sit down. You're going to have to deal with Midget Wesley. I'm not standing up anymore. I'm not either. I, I, this is... I, I'm hoping it, there's some... Um, the game's not the problem, awesome. Roots. It's us. We're the problem. So, oh, we're the problem. Yeah, of course. All right, so I recalibrated, right. so now I'm a midget. But I should look you like I'm standing look like up. like a midget. Okay. How about me? Do I look like I'm uh, a midget? Here, let me you recalibrate. You look like you're squatting now. You look like you're I on a squatty potty. Oh, my God, you look like a child. Do I really? Yeah, it's funny. Hey. What's up? <laughs> Munchkin. What's up, Munchkin land. Munchkin high five. five. Okay, we got this. We got All right, this. Anyway. Um, All right. Oculus Quest 3 obviously coming. I think it's coming next year. Uh, it'll be uh, it'll be a moderate step up. You know, I, I think that it's they have adopted the smartphone uh, model, and we're going to get moderate steps. We're going to get new hardware all the time, but it's not going to be every year. And just because they mention it on a, a investor call doesn't mean that uh, the time is now. 
Now, I could be wrong, always, uh, but I normally am not, so. <laughs> Here we go. Well, I trust your judgment. There's oh, right there's there. me in there? Yeah. I got him. Hold on. Down. See, this part's fun. Hey! Got another one down. He there's a guy in here, and he's, he's shooting me. I can't get to my ammo bag. Well, just just my hide. I, I got you. I got him. Damn. I I got him. No, just kidding. <laughs> I didn't. Okay. Uh, hey, what is this? Is this the thing? Uh, it might be actually. Let's see. I don't know. Do we blow it up, or what are we supposed to no, do? No, that's not it. There's a thing that you have to put a code into. Okay. And then when you put the code in, you have to defend for like a minute or something, or they come at oh, you. Oh God, no. We're scared. All right, let's um, drop your clip a... and put a new one in. Always reload when you have a chance to reload. All right, and I'll keep my charge in case there's a building that we can't get into. There's some stairs here. Do you want to go upstairs or? I'm sure. I'm sure there's dudes up there. Yep, there's a dude at the top. Got him. Right, um, anyway, the next thing I wanted to talk to you about, I wanted to get your thoughts on this App Lab. Have you heard about App Lab? I have not. I saw uh, somebody did a video, and I can't remember who it was. I saw it on YouTube, and I don't. All right. It said App Lab, the amazing App Lab. All right. So, or... App Lab, are you away from the charge, by the way? I am. All right. App Lab. No, it's going out. Oh right. fuck me! It is. You got another one, right? You have a secondary charge. Yeah. Yeah, but where are we gonna take it though? Well, we'll figure that out. I just thought we had game over because we didn't have any more charges. Um. Oh, I do not I have another charge. You don't. Let me see what. what I do, do you not. Have? What's your secondary thing then? I got a gun, and that's it. I don't know. You dropped something then. I mean, we you have two oh, items. Maybe. I used one in uh, the beginning. So. Yeah. Yeah, you have to see how you can have. We go back, maybe you see how you maybe have we can go back down. Four holsters. When you look down, do you see four holsters? I see two empty ones and then the right one. Yeah. And some bag or something. Ammo bag, I guess. Yeah. So let's right. go back down. Let's go. We might be able to find it without, without needing any explosives. But uh, App Lab yeah. is. Um, Remind me, by the way, when we between games for me to go back and change my loadout to have two charges. Uh, App Lab is the Oculus answer to side quest. Okay. It's the uh, it's the unofficial it's the official unofficial app store for Oculus Quest. Okay. And the way it's going to work, it's actually cooler than we thought it was going to be, because. Um, I mean, I I haven't used it yet, but my understanding of what this thing is is it's like uh, like a, just an app, and it'll advertise games and shit in it, and uh, you you click on the game that you're interested in, whether it's free or paid, it'll send you the game's website, and then you can download the game from there or buy it or whatever. Now the cool thing about it is what we weren't expecting. Is this not going to be like a regular side quest app that goes into your unknown sources apps? It'll go into mm -hmm. your real Oculus library. There will be real automated uh, updates and everything with it, like you bought it from the Oculus store. Uh, That's pretty cool. Which is pretty cool. So here's the question. Obviously, they're trying pretty hard to make this thing a success by allowing uh, these indie developers... To have access to back-end oculus services like that um, but in order for this thing to be a success right they they need they need some pretty big help from developers to put some real games on it that people want now if you're a to the top or a, or a touring cards or somebody who couldn't get on the oculus quest store I mean, here's your chance to, to, to get on there, but 
do you do it? I mean, the shoe's on the other foot now, right? Oculus needs right. to the top now instead of vice versa. Uh, what do you do if you're these guys? I guess it depends. I'd almost want to give Facebook the big middle finger. But that's a lot of money you're leaving like, on the table. You, you got to think you can sell your game now right on the Oculus Quest. People don't have to sideload it. So all these like people who sideloading is just too much for them. And there's a lot of them out there now. Uh, now these people can buy the games right there on the headset. And uh, that's a pretty big market for them to walk away from. And like, whereas on side quest uh, to the top, for example, couldn't, couldn't use multiplayer because they didn't have access to like the Oculus stuff that you need for multiplayer. Now right. it's all good. Now they could do it. They could put the multiplayer back into the top and uh, sell it right there on the headset. No side loading required. That's a lot of money to walk away from to make a point, right? Right. Well, it depends. It depends on if they've already got an answer or they what it depends on what they've been doing. But yeah, I mean, it's their, it's their chance. Um, I don't know. See, I'm in a, in a weird boat because I, I don't want to play a bunch of free shit and I don't want to buy games that aren't good enough to make it on the store. Well, I think to the top is a perfect example of why, well, that's flawed thinking. I mean, obviously to the top's awesome just because they didn't put it on the store. doesn't mean that it's not good enough to be on the store, you know? I'm, no, but I already have, I have access to that game and that's a rare, I think it's a rare game that's, well, I don't know. I, 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 we'll know. See. I mean, I, I haven't seen anything on side quest so far and granted, I, I get it. It's different. It's a different store. It's a different, it's, it's backed by Oculus. Right, but when hey, I look right, at how about quest this? And I look uh, all that shit, I just, it doesn't interest me. How about this? All right. If you're going to judge thing, uh, a game's quality by whether or not it's on the official store or not, uh, app, app lab launched today and the big, uh, the big draw uh, was they have Crisis Brigade 1 and 2 on there now. I mean, that, that's not crap, is it? No, it's just st stuff I can get on PC VR. I know it, but, but that's not the point. The point is is that you can't use that as a, a judgment of quality, whether or not... Well, it, no, it, but I'm saying for me personally, I App Lab doesn't mean shit to me. I get it. It's going to be well, good. For obviously, the, for it don't mean store, you don't even have a quest but, anymore. Obviously, it wouldn't mean shit. Right, but even if I had the quest too, I I haven't been running to get side loaded stuff, and so I, I I don't know. I'm in a weird position right now as far as uh, it's like I was saying about Stride. You know, if I wouldn't play it flat, if that game was flat, I wouldn't play it. So being in VR isn't going to make me want to play it. It, it it needs to have the quality behind it as well. Well, I, I agree um, with that. You... I, I agree with that to an extent, but I I, I disagree with the idea that uh, a game would be the same in VR as it is flat. Putting certain games in VR uh, absolutely would make them more compelling. Certain games, not every game, but certain games. The Stride specifically, I agree with because the, they promised. One, you know, a bunch of things, one of which I wanted, and the one thing that I wanted is the one thing they haven't put in there yet. So, yeah, yeah. I, I don't care about that. But um, with this uh, App Lab, I haven't loaded, downloaded anything from SideQuest either, hardly anything. But most of that has to do with the fact that I don't want to fucking deal with side loading stuff. But now I don't have to. Now I can just go right on to the fucking Quest and, and get this stuff without just like i was buying it from the quest store so like i think this is kind of a big deal and i think that there's gonna be a lot of good games on there because we've our oculus has already shown that they're willing to turn down good games and i think that there's other reasons that they're rejecting these games i don't think it's quality based i think that they're playing some uh, inside baseball here and uh anthony did you watch me on vr365 the other day I did not. I'm gonna reset this. Not. This I'm gonna reset this by the way because we we're kind of at checkmate here. But uh, Anthony brought up something the other day that sounded kind of weird to me. But now seeing how they're doing this, it makes a little more sense actually. And um, why don't we just kill each other? Because I don't know if I can reset this without having to make a new game. <laughs> Ugh, motherfucker. 
<laughs> uh, you have to kill yourself. I um. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good one. But uh, Anthony asked the question: Why? Why, why are, are all of these uh, quest apps? There's like seemingly there's a lot of quest apps that have timed exclusivity on quest that nobody mentions them as being exclusive to quest like you've noticed these games that are only on quest for a little while and then they come out to the like everything else but they never get announced as quest exclusive so his theory was is that they have some kind of deal with the oculus some kind of unspoken deal to get placement on their store premium ad space to sell their game and in exchange they they can only be on quest for a little while which i thought was kind of like conspiracy talk to me but now seeing uh, thinking about it in the the context of this app lab and how these great games kind of get cast aside that really doesn't sound all that far-fetched to me anymore yeah i mean it could make it would make sense you know i mean obviously you want to um you want to have incentives. You want, I mean, the, the you want it. The, it's good for the quest to have stuff uh, exclusive, right? Even if it's an unsaid deal. Yeah, yeah, I, I, and that was kind of what I said to him. There's like, even if it is kind of an under table, under the table thing, it's you can't really blame Oculus for for wanting to have these kinds of deals. It's not really a shady thing, you know. No. I imagine if it's under the table, it's because the dev wants it to be under the table. Fuck! These guys are a lot smarter than you were making it sound like, dude. They've obviously updated this they, game a lot. Yeah, as soon as I, um, oh god, I lost, I did ha I do have two of these things. I must have lost one last time because I'm dropping them That's all over good. the place. We might need them. Give me, give it to me. Thank you. Oh but, god. uh... No, I'm going to try out App Lab. I, I didn't come on here today to really give my impressions on the thing uh, as a product, but I wanted to see what you thought about that weird position it puts these devs it, in. Yeah. yeah, it does kind of, it is kind of weird. I mean, after they've been dicked over, now that, now they're, they have, they're in the, power position well and did, and maybe they were holding some of these back for the specific reason because they knew app lab was coming and they were going to want to have some good stuff on it i don't know uh, i think that might be an explosive right there roots on the ground see that right there where oh yeah is that, that is it's a uh it's clear that's what killed you that one time yeah, huh? yeah i think so all right so i don't know where we're supposed to go? Let's go back downstairs. Um, but I'm going to try out the App Lab. I'm going to play that Ancient Dungeon. People say that's pretty good. And it's on there for free. So, uh... Okay, let me ask you this. So, they're obviously clearly doing something with App Lab. They're taking away side quests. They took it away, well, really. Well, they... they so the way that I'm reading these articles, they've got side quests now set up as kind of a, a median... So you'll still go to SideQuest to browse all this shit. And uh, instead of having like links to Itch.io and stuff like it does now, it'll just mm -hmm. it'll just link you to uh, App Lab instead. Well, because, um, you know, so it's it's kind of a... Uh, I forgot what I was going to say. Now, I don't know what um, kind of how SideQuest is going to monetize through all this and what that's going to well, mean. Well, somebody was telling me recently that Actually, I saw in a video they were saying the first after right, the first you weren't going to be enemy. able to. You weren't going to be able to do dev mode anymore. You weren't going to be able to do um. Set up virtual desktop. They were saying, "Hey, you need to get it set up before the first, or you're not going to be able to do it." Now, what does that mean? Uh, yeah, that is a good question it, because because I can't really see Oculus. You think Oculus would allow virtual desktop to publish through App Lab? Because the whole the whole deal the whole reason the Oculus because used to the Oculus Store version of a virtual desktop included mm -hmm. the streaming stuff, and then Oculus made them take it out because they couldn't guarantee the quality of it. 
Well, that's kind of what they say App Lab is for, right? The, these apps that they can't guarantee the quality of. So they might just let him uh, put virtual desktop on App Lab. So you don't that's have possible. to. So you don't even have to sideload anymore, which I think is really. Oh shit! They don't want people getting in developer mode. That's kind of weird to have Watch a developer out. account, right? You got him. He's down. Here's the bomb. Oh, we did it. We did it! We made it here. We made it this far. We didn't. Fuck, I'm dead. Oh, God. <laughs> That's funny, dude. All right. We so... did it, and then you die. All right, so... so... Oh, God. No, hey. Hey, I'm sorry. I'm hey, sorry. All right, he's going down the hall. To the left. I can't. I gotta. I gotta get my ammo, and I can't grab my ammo right, thing. I'm, I'm watching. He's problem. coming. He's, he's in the room behind you now. now. Well, somebody made me get short and and sit down, and now I can't grab my shit, dude. All right. He's through the door to your right. Two rooms over. This one. Yeah. This one. Two rooms over. Yep. See him over there. Well, no, I think this could potentially be good for side quests and everybody. Consumers. I think it'll Oculus. be good in the long run, right? But do I, what do I do here? Type in the number you see, bro. I'm typing it, too. It's not doing Maybe it. Maybe you have to trigger it or... I don't know. No, there we go. All right, now you got to defend. What?! No! Scared, West. Where are you, West? I need you. Hey! Uh, I'm, I'm over your shoulder, bro. Hey! Get me! I'm looking for these dudes. I don't see them really, though. I need to stand up, man. This is definitely not working sitting down anymore. They're flanking you? Is that where they're coming from? Did we win? I think we did it. We did it. Now you have to get back on the truck. That's right. You have to get make it back to the truck. Oh, what? Yeah, you got to get out of here. I don't know how to get out of here. Do you still have a bomb? Yeah. Make a door. Where's the outside wall, though? That's the question. Probably I'm any assuming. one of these that have caught any of these that have uh, boarded up windows. That's probably an outside wall. No, apparently not. Oh, I've lost you. I don't even know where you're at anymore. I hear you. I'm so scared and lost. I don't think there's anybody alive oh, in here Oh, yeah, anymore. there's a guy upstairs. That's what I hear. He's up here walking in place. I heard your explosive. I'm outside. Yeah, I see you. You're floating. <laughs> Am I? Yeah, oh, because yeah, cause you, cause you stood up, yeah. All right, where's the truck? Okay. Where's Mr. T in the van, man? I don't know, dude. We need the we need it all set up. And we'll float up in there. Actually, it was usually it wasn't Murdoch that was getting. No, I guess it wasn't. It was Mr. T and I. He's all fixing it up and shit. Murdoch always did the distraction. Or I see it. I don't see you. I don't see the truck. I'm going. We're probably going around the wrong long way. I'm gonna see if I, are you inside the wall or outside the wall? I'm outside. All right. So let me see if I can find you. I still don't see you yet. I don't see any. You must truck, be on man. the complete opposite side then. I can. I've. This is the fourth side I'm about to go around. So if it's not around this corner, I don't know where it's well, at. It's, it's not parked beside the building. You have to walk down the bank. Oh God, dude, I'm so screwed. Okay, um. I'm trying to find you. I still don't see you. Okay, I see you. Go up so the, keep going the way go you're going. Heaven. Just keep going the way you're going and then go around to the right. And uh, it'll be there. Is 
So you said, but my point is, is like if they're if they're you know, like I said, they they don't do the um you can't sign up for the developer mode. What is anymore right now? So how I mean, it'll be interesting to see how they're going to allow people to um hook up wirelessly, like you said. I mean, through the I guess through the app lab, but you're still going to have to um hide out. New compound, I guess, or hide out. Uh, either way. We can do a nighttime thing work. if you want. You can go nighttime with yeah. it as well. That's true. Um, but yeah, it'll be interesting to see if they if there's certain things they don't allow on App Lab. Uh, it's going to be an interesting time. Am I back to life? I'm back to life. You did it. You saved me. I did. Well, we won. We did it. We did. Now it's uh, going to be interesting to see how much replay because that was fun i mean it's fun it's challenging now finally and uh now it's all the fun all of a sudden it's fun be nice to have more than two people like a group before yeah well we can patreon right yep a couple patrons exactly right Boom. who doesn't like to blow shit up yeah all right entering the building on guard I'm going to take the left, you take the right. Sounds good. I don't see anybody. So, yeah, we definitely uh, live in interesting times in the VR world here because we've got, you know, Valve. That one? Valve that's uh, spouting off new numbers every day about how great Steam VR is doing because they got 2 million people trying it now. And then, uh, but I thought they said that, um, Gabe was going to read our mind. Yeah, he's working on it. I think it, honestly, I think that's where his focus is at, to be quite honest. Um, well, they want to do different stuff, right? If the, I mean, that would be revolutionary if they had the first headset that could really use your mind to, to change things up. He right? said, he said it, it, that the tech is in a usable state as it is, but they're, they're, too afraid it's advancing so fast that they're too afraid to make a commercial product uh, out of it because they're afraid of stopping uh the progress like it would take time for them to to make a product and by the time they had something that they could sell to people the te technology their technology would be up. way past it already yeah so right, i'm upstairs so, i haven't seen any yeah i'm, I'm just searching down downstairs um, so yeah, they're afraid to make a product right now for fear of s slowing down. And that really should tell you a lot about the state of this tech. How fast things are moving. Yeah. So. Now, is there any, do you have any apprehensions of, of the, what Gabe's doing? Or are you like everybody else that's like, oh, you're paranoid, man. Well, look, man, uh, the stuff that they're doing right now doesn't really scare me or bother me it's all read oh god it's all mind reading stuff it's not uh the other way now when they get to the part where they want you to plug in and let the computer take over your brain for a little while now that's going to take some trust trust that i don't have currently i think yeah, I've got no, let me, i don't know where let me it's ask you from. this okay when and if they were to be able to write on your mind and all that stuff do you think there's any possibility that they would maybe lie <laughs> like you know what i mean do you think there's a possibility that we may be told hey yeah no it's only this and we have no idea what else it's doing or if if it is reading stuff like what is it reading where is it where does that stop and who who controls what's stopping? You know what I mean? Well, again, we, like, we've, had, I, we've had this conversation before when it comes to privacy issues. Privacy's dead, bro. It's it's long gone. It, it is it is dead, but do you really want to kick it up a notch, six or seven notches? Really? You know what I mean? Like, at some point, um, it, it ah. might not just be about the the, uh, the easy stuff that we're, or the little things. And, oh, God, what is this guy doing? He's all over the place, dude. What is happening? Dude, this <laughs> This dude was like laying down, bopping around, dodging my bullets. 
um, <laughs> like in a weird way where he, I don't know what the hell that was, dude. He's dead. Okay. Um, Objective destroyed. Uh, you blew up the bomb. Yeah. They. Oh my God. There's 16 people in there. Jesus. Oh, I just locked up or something. Are you locking up? It's because we're coming back to the thing. I hope so. You are you not? You're not in the thing with me. Or, there you are. I am now. Right. Yeah. Um. Uh, I don't know. I I I look at things is uh, there's so many things going on, and you're right. There is no privacy anymore. But I I just don't know that I want shit reading my mind. You no, know, no, that's like, the cool thing. You don't you don't have to have it. That's the cool thing. You don't have to have it. This stuff that they're that they're using is just all it's EEG, EKG. It's all medical equipment. It's stuff that's already being used in hospitals for other things. Um, and if it's not, if it's something more nefarious, people are going to find that out, dude. There's, you can't keep that a secret. And it's not a big grand conspiracy God. between Valve and everybody else. So, like... Oh, this we're already here? Dude, what a fucking Hell pick. Yeah. And look at the fucking setup we've got to defend here, dude. We have no back door. Like, we have one door to defend. Unless they breach. Oh, shit. You're right. I'm going outside. Oh god, he's dying. Oh. oh shit, here they come! Fuck, I'm dead! There's six There's of them out here. Oh. There's six of them. Yeah, that's what I saw before when they came in. They were around. That's exactly what it well, was. The, they're, they're chasing me now, so like... <laughs> I'm, I'm he's like... coming in? Oh fuck, Dude, I'm, he's in, doing I'm that, in... He's doing that weird leg thing! I'm in a dead Dude. end. How do they? How? Like, how do you kill something like that, dude? Did they give up? All right. Dude, they are. They what they do is they lay down and they bop around. Like if you're, they're over here. You got to come in here quick. <laughs> I'm are you dead? I'm coming. No, I, I'm... they like lay down and then uh, they fuck, like fuck, pop fuck, up fuck. And, then, and they're like spinning around. Like fuck, stop shooting me. It is the weirdest thing I've ever seen, dude. Right on the corner? You got this, dude. I'm trying, man. He's the last one. Time is almost up. It's the fuse. We already oh, got him get down. Got him down. Got him down. Gotta get to the truck. Dude. For fuck's sake. Alright, so was there something you wanted to show me? Oh. Um, Damn, there's a lot of dead people I in here. Good job. Well, basically, like I said, they like you go to you shoot dead? them and they fall, they fall down and they're like laying down and then they pivot around in a circle, like leaning down and pop up and bop back down. Like, I don't know what the fuck, man. Like, how does somebody do that? Are you dead, Roots? I am dead. Yeah. I just found your body and it's heartbreaking. One of these, yeah. One of these people down here that you My were uh, talking about being dead is me. My friends. Yeah. Your little backpack, little guy. See, I don't even see my body. All right, we have to escape. Enough morning roots. We have to move on. We're so, gotta go on to the next one. Survivors keep moving. I guess we can go to the hideout and try a night night run. Huh? Yeah, we'll do that. We'll do a night time run, um, and we'll uh, and then we'll call it a, an episode. I mean, it'll be, it, I guess it's, it, it's interesting time as far as what's going to happen, but it's, uh, I don't know, like you said, I don't have a quest too. So my, um, interest in some of it is kind of faded a little bit as far as what I can see, but it'll still be interesting to All see. Right, so I'm going to switch my primary item here to another wall charge. So I got two wall charges, pistol, and my rifle. Good to go. All right, and then on the thing, we're gonna go to procedural nighttime. Ba boom. Confirm but that. But what you were saying, like about uh, like stride and stuff, which is very true. Like some games, you are gonna be better in VR. I just feel like, like if you took Subway Surfer and said, okay, you're gonna be doing Subway Surfer in VR, but it's not. It's not the same. You're not. It's not a mobile game. You're actually on the sub, the subway, and you're jumping from train to train. And I would say, big fucking deal. You know what I mean? Like, 
there's just some things that it doesn't matter if you put it in VR. It's oh, just not going to make well, for sure. that much better. For sure. Um, you can't polish a turd, dude. For sure. I, I just, uh, I'm just starting to, I just want gameplay. Like I want that, like that gameplay loop that you said in Godfall, there's a reason why you get addicted to it. It may be simple, but they more developers need to bring that Look, gameplay uh, loop into VR. That's a bad you example. That That's a bad example. That game is addictive, but I wouldn't call it fun. You know what I mean? It's just kind of something. To, well, I've never, I've never played it, but for you to be able to sit for four hours and play a game it, like that's, it's just, that's what triple a flat games do. Even if it's shit, I, it still engages you. That loop is what the, the, the grinding, the, the compl- constantly upgrading. Apple, there, there's apples something and oranges. to that. Apples and oranges to me. I would take a mediocre VR game over that. Well, and I've never played it. But I, I just, I'm almost to the point where I don't want to play mediocre VR games anymore. Let's see, I'm, I, you know, I, I would prefer it to a flat game. The only, the only reason, the only difference is, is that the VR experience is so overwhelming to the senses. It's not something I can do for a long period of time. Whereas a flat game, uh, they could put you doing like something super, uh, uh, you know, super repetitive and, uh, and really just the beautiful visuals are enough to keep you doing it to be quite honest the 4k hdr is the best part of it and uh and it doesn't overwhelm you like two hours in vr i gotta take the headset off uh i I think there's some i think there's something more to it i think it's not just overwhelming of senses i think the flicker rate um uh, and the 90 hertz and whatever's going on in the headset it's just it taxes you. It's draining. It's not. It does. Fuck! I need it, to cut my gun back. Uh, yeah, yeah. It, it, exactly. That's from exactly my point. I enjoy the the VR experience much more, but I can't. Fuck! I can't sustain in it like I can with a flat game. So that's why what, what I meant the other day when I said I like in playing flat games more to watching television than playing a VR game. It's a closer thing to me. Right, I'm getting a new clip because I have a feeling we're close. All these dudes. Either that, or it did seem like last time I played that. Uh, by the way, is that a, a live charge here? There you go. Okay. Uh, by the way, that's how funny is it? Your charge is like bigger than your whole tor- torso. I know. Uh, it's like ridiculous. But uh, I forgot what I was going to say now. Um. Oh, it seems like last time I played this that it did get more difficult as I won more matches. So that might be what's going on here, too. But, um, yeah, that, that's what I meant the other day when I said that really playing the flat games, it didn't really, I hear the bomb, it's close. Uh, didn't really take away from my VR time. It took more away from my YouTube and TV oh, watching it. time. Did you find it? You did find it. That's funny, dude. Like, I walked into a room and started talking to you, and it was an enemy. <laughs> did you really? Yeah. That is funny. I think I'm safe back here. Fuck, man. I'm going to come in the room and take them out as they come in to try to defuse it so do we have a loophole here like can't i just leave the building and no matter what happens to you we win uh if uh, if it doesn't get messed with probably yeah long yeah i think i mean one of us has ended i think that's how yeah that's how we won last time like you got killed but i was just outside i think we diffused it yep we did it we did it I'm coming back. So we'll give our thoughts on the game itself on uh, Virtual Show Wednesday, uh, along with Death Horizon Reloaded. We'll, we've done a couple co-op games this week. We'll talk about them. Oh, dude, see, this is what I'm talking about. This dude is doing weird stuff, like flopping around on the ground. All right, I'm outside. <laughs> oh, uh, see if you go in there. Does it? Do we win without me being in there? I don't know. I'm walk back in to catch your little dude flopping around here. Yeah, they're not still not too bright. They're walking, just standing there. 
Are there still enemies in here? Live? Yeah, there's a whole bunch of enemies. All right, I'm going. I'm to killing them all, but they're not. They're not just not. They're just kind of standing and walking <laughs> around in the in the they're stairwell. De they're depressed because we did no! the bomb. Dude, he's doing that thing where he pops down on the ground and then pops back up. I'm coming. I'm I'm close now. He's dead. Oh my god, they're on the stairs. Yeah, they are. Boom. You can't shoot them between the stairs. Well, you can. I shot him in the balls and it killed him. Okay. So we gotta get out of here. Gotta get out of here. Let's make a door. Yeah. Let's double charge it. I just put... I don't even know if that's an outside wall. Oh, God. I hope so. Oh, can nope. I move my charge? I can. <laughs> oh. Let's go through another wall. Bing. Oh, that's it. Yeah. We did it. We did Boom, it. Boom, I die. I don't know if this is the right at, at side, though. I don't think it is. No, probably not. You'd think that the driver would have enough courtesy to come around and get us. Yeah, what's he doing down there? Oh, wait, He's what chilling. road did we come in on? Where's the road? There is no road. Where we're going, we this don't is, uh, need back roads. Back to the Future, exactly. It is Back <laughs> to the Future, bro. All right, man. So, are we going to call it an episode now, or... or... We want to go I again. would say so. I don't know if there's too much more we can do in the game anyway. Um, no, I think we have a good idea of what this is. And let me tell you, I'm so glad. It is, you know, without going too deep on it, it's way better than it was before. I'm so happy that we waited to play it because yeah. we would not have had this good of an experience before, I assure you. you know, I wonder if it scales up with multiple more people, right? I don't know. We can certainly uh, give that a shot. I mean, because yeah, it's, cause it's Viport, right? right yeah, that's what I was talking to uh, Radio Run about. Is uh, that uh, he was saying it's on Viport now. And um, so, what do you, let me ask you this. We brought up Stride. What do you think about the fact that, because I, I, it hit me a little. I was a little pissed. <laughs> I see them announcing the PlayStation VR version, and I'm like, what the fuck, dude? Like, yeah. where is the story campaign? Yeah. They the, promise. They're still now promising they're just... it. They're, they're still promising well, it. Well, and I don't... Uh, P PSVR without parole says that we'll have it by the end of the year, but fuck, man, we should have it now, you know? Yeah, we should have had it on release, and, you know, and what have they been doing on play PS PC VR this whole time? Nothing, right? I mean, I guess updating some things, right? Well, but they, I don't they know. added one game mode. Like they gave us everything that they promised, except for the campaign. Now, hopefully, hopefully, this means that the campaign is what we want it to be, right? Like they could have given us a, a watered down, half ass piece of shit campaign. Maybe they, True. maybe they have a quality standard that they're trying to hold themselves to, and that's why it's taking so long. Yeah. Get... yeah, I mean, and if, I, and if I'm being 100% honest, like, the entire game didn't really grab me to begin with. Like, some people love parkour running on roofs and stuff, so it's hard for me to be excited about it, but I'm sure it'll be good. Um, but I was already a little negative on it to begin with, just because it doesn't seem like my type of game. Well, see, that appeals but... to me. If, you, see, if, they're shooting, if it was just running, I'd say, eh. But the fact that you're doing all this parkour shit with guns and enemies, that sounds great. I need a, I need a, a narrative to, to tie it all together for me. Something to point and through. there needs to be stuff in between it. It can't just be on the rooftops. Like, there needs to be stuff happening in the buildings. Now I got to escape. Now we're on the rooftops shooting dudes. You know right. what I mean? I, I don't want to just stay on the rooftops for the whole game at, at, at that point. What's the point of even having a narrative if you're on the rooftop the whole time? It's got to be a stupid yeah. narrative. True, true. You know, and that. So I guess uh, my the way I said, you know, subway surfer or whatever, because I that's what I I feel like it's a glorified subway surfer with shooting. And now that's me without trying it, but um, hopefully there'll be an amazing campaign 
and uh, I'll feel completely different about it. Yeah, I'll, I'll try it. People like it. People that play it now like it, but uh, I'm not going to try it till it has what I want in it. I'm going to wait for the final full experience. I'm going to pull an Alex here and and uh, say no to early access. We're going to wait for the full release. Yeah, well, especially the campaign. Yeah, you know, I've been doing some um, Autica campaign, working my way through that the last. Uh, oh, by the way, uh, speaking of which, the uh, Synth Riders guy wrote me an email thanking us for covering his game on the uh, on the virtual show and uh, thanking us for our feedback. And he's going to implement our suggestions into the game. So campaign nice. coming up, some direction for new players coming up. Uh, more experiences coming up. All this. You know stuff. what? Uh, Mash Mash Daddy told me that uh, he spoke to them and he gave, got a free copy of it, and they gave him ten free keys to give away. Awesome, dude. Yeah. Sometimes I wonder about these devs, man. That just give their way, game 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 away to anybody that talks to them. That's kind of crazy. I mean, it's, it's completely <laughs> nice, well, but I mean, you're trying to make money, you know. Well, he's got 40, it's because he's got, got that 45,000 person group for Facebook. Oh, so. yeah, yeah, I forgot about but, that. Uh, yeah. So, it's, uh, I wish we got 10 keys. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? We got two, though. That's good enough. Yeah. I mean, yeah and, you know, okay. I didn't have to ask for them. Like, he, he, he found us and offered them to us, which was cool. That's true. Yeah, that is true. That's true. Anyway, I think that's going to uh, that's going to wrap up the money show. Whatever the hell number this is, I'll be sure that it's numbered correctly when I upload it. Uh, but uh, cool roots, we, we need yeah. to do this more often. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. And Patreons, let us know what your thoughts are in on the video comments. Uh, what your what your thoughts are on everything we just talked about? Yeah, for sure. And we're we're going to kind of pick it up in a peripheral way on the. Uh, virtual show obviously we're not going to rehash the same conversation that we just had but we're going to talk about this game we're going to talk about uh, death horizon reloaded which by now you should have seen the uh the uh, video up on the channel for that and then uh i'm going to uh i'm going to check out app lab and uh and we'll give a few uh, a few thoughts on it uh, as well, and uh, probably something else, probably one other game or something we'll talk about. And the two TBD, maybe, maybe Vin, maybe we'll go in and check out the uh, Vin updates and see what they look like. They did they when did they update that? They up the new thing stuff that they were going to implement, yeah. The thing we were talking about on the show the other day, it was already implemented when we it was a report. Oh, yeah. Well, I, I definitely say we should go in there then and, and check it out just so that we can let people know. Um, hopefully, I'm hoping, I'm hoping, uh, everything's option based. Well, but, the, uh, the level redesigns are just level redesigns. Those are not option based. That's done. They redesign the levels. No, I mean like, oh, so you, so there is no from a distance thing. Well, uh, the ones, the yeah. Well, there are certain parts. The parts that people had the most trouble with, those are gone. That sucks. It does. I think it's going to suck, but obviously we need to try it before we decide. So that's true. Maybe it'll be better. I don't think it will, but maybe it will be. Eh, it's just like everything else. It's like, oh, this is too hard for us, so let's dumb it down for everybody. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> but uh, anyway, uh, it's been fun, man. We will do this again soon. Yeah. Uh, I don't know what we're going to play next. We we, uh, we have a few of these that we can get into. So Anyway, you guys want to play, yep. let us know. Uh, the game is available on viport infinity so uh we got room for two more and uh, i had enough fun in it to uh, give it another shot with more people yeah i'd like to just see if it scales up and um let's see what to do right i wish it seemed like the ai still has a little bit of improvement but uh definitely like you said it's better than what you Fuck. were describing yeah i so. killed most of them outside before i even breached the walls like wow that i would literally go stand next to the rock snipe people off and then more would come outside and i'd snipe them there was no boarded up windows and doors like everything was open 
and uh, they would all just come outside, and it would leave like two or three people inside. I'd kill those, defuse the bomb, and then defend, which wasn't a problem. It was easy to defend. Get in the truck and go home. Never got killed once. Wow. Yeah. That's crazy. Yep. Anyway, uh, thanks again, you guys, for uh, being patrons. You guys are awesome, and uh, we'll see you again real soon. Yep. Absolutely. Bye.